one real one Chevy. Hey everyone, welcome to I Just Watched. It's your boys, and we're here to watch and check out Halo the series official trailer 2. It's gonna be on Paramount Plus, Paramount Plus Original. Um, you know about Halo. I grew up playing that shit. Mm -hmm. Like Halo's amazing. Master Chief is a character, the world. The first three are mwah. So I am excited for this to see Master Chief come to life. There's a few things that I've heard that I already dislike because it alters and changes and deals with the character. But before we get into all that good shenanigans, I gotta hit you with the usual, which is hopefully you like this video enough to smash the like button, click the subscribe to stay tuned to see more of our items, and hit the little bell to get notified when they drop. That being said, let's check this out. Searching on me. Hugs, baby. Bro, visually, I think this is gonna be pretty. I wanna see a hunter so bad. And a little sticky grenade. And then There's a little something out run like this. Master Chief got here. Character wise? Mm -hmm. Got here. It's like. Open your eyes. For the first time. I've been living in the dark. Your rage. Blinds you. Rage. That's all I have left. Where, where my character The covenant will not stop. Oh, the sword! I... What else are you willing to sacrifice? Yeah, the, What's the point in saving humanity if we're gonna give up our own? I'm interested in finding a way to be less reliant on Dr. Halsey moving forward. The truth could bring us all down. There is something within us. Something sacred. Something worth protecting. I mean, it sucks because I know that the actor is cool and all. It just I don't. It doesn't sound like Master Chief. We're all we have now. He looked good though. It's just us. I love Master Chief. He's, I love Master Chief. <laughs> all right, everyone. So I obviously someone's really excited. <laughs> I love, dude. That's this much, bro. It's Master Chief. Hey, like I, I, this has the opportunity. It, it's a, look, look, it looks visually stunning. I told you, visually, it's gonna look glorious. I, it I, looks like Master Chief. I have to, I have to like watch like the story. Yeah, I got, I got you. And like, cause, cause I have no idea what the fuck's gonna be going on. I have no idea what the. I just know that he's, he's like, he's basically ma Xbox mascot. <laughs> he is the mascot for bro, Xbox. He <laughs> is. You know how PlayStation got Kratos? Yeah. They got Master Chief. Oh, yeah, Master Chief's a Spartan. Future Spartan. He's a Spartan. <laughs> He's the best, the baddest, the toughest, the roughest. It's Master Chief. It's the man. I saw pictures of Cortana. She looks kind of whack because it looks like a person that's supposed to look like Cortana versus like a little AI because she's supposed to be see-through. She's like DB most of the time. And like they have this weird relationship because like they fall in love with each other. But, um, but she's an AI. <laughs> she's an AI. And he's also a Spartan. So like he's, he's not supposed to love and shit, but you know, he loves. Um, I'm excited. My thing is, the games, the first three, because after that, the games are still fun, but the story starts to get a little wacky-dacky and shit. Mm. But the original trilogy, the story is great. The first one is very, it's very set up. It's interesting, like, oh shit, the Halo, the aliens survive, we gotta win, blah, 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 blah. Mm. The second one, your best friend, he's not really your best friend, but your best friend is Arbiter. He's awesome, because he's also getting betrayed by those fucking long neck alien folks. You see in the chill and these and good. Yeah, so I'm excited to see things like that. All right, like the warthog having him go to work. Yeah. My only issue is like when he's like, "All right, team, on me," and I was like, "Oh, that's not. Yep. I, that's not. That is that's not like, Master Chief. It's like watching a Kratos movie and not having a Kratos like voice. Mm -hmm. It would affect me the whole time. Because it's he technically says, on the works, by the way. Yeah, which I'm excited for because Kratos is my boy. And if they skip the original three story, I'm fighting, rioting on in sight. the streets, <laughs> boy. On sight, rioting. <laughs> um, 
But no, like he looks like Master Chief. My biggest issue that I said that I've heard is that we're gonna see Homeboy, aka the actor's face, consistently because they're like, we need to tell the story. Suck a duck, bro. Because <laughs> that's one of the things with Master Chief. He, whenever it's like the Mando, never takes off his helmet. If he does, you never see his face. And even in Mando season two, when you see his face, it was such a build up. It was just like I, we, I'm not supposed to do this, but it's a life or death situation, so I have to. And it was a glimpse, it was a moment, and the people who saw his face all got slaughtered, except for Bill Burr. Uh, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. But the Spartan, like, the, I think it's like because he takes it off twice. Because the second time is whenever he says goodbye to Grogu. Yeah, that's that, the only time. That's his son. It's it, different. It, that's Mijo. That's his. He's like, I love you. You love me. We bonded for life. Hey, hey, you know who I look like. Yeah. This so right just, here, Daddy. Um, <laughs> that garbage. Yeah, but exactly. <laughs> I don't know who that is, but I trust him a little bit. But like, no. So even in the games, if I remember correctly, I think Master Chief takes his helmet off like twice in the first three, and you see like uh, like the back of his head a little bit, maybe some cheek, but like you never see his face. That's the one thing you mm -hmm. never see his face. Yeah. Um, the only time you see his face is when there's a flashback and he's like young and he's talking about training, mm -hmm. but it doesn't like, but like, it doesn't matter because even then, if I remember correctly, you don't get like a, a glimpse. It's just like a body and like kind of mm -hmm. out of focus or whatever. But that's one of the characters like, what's the word? Titular? 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 You know the word? No, 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 no. You got it right. Uh, did I? Yeah, you got it right. Titular. Titular or something like that. Yeah. I can't smart sometimes. Mm -hmm. That's a big part of this character. I didn't want to mess it up, so I didn't want to. I'll use big. No, 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 no. Uh, so I'm kind of worried on that. I think it can be great because the story is there. Mm -hmm. The characters are there. Visually, there's a bunch of cool stuff. I mean, the warthogs, the laser sword, the weaponry. Just There's a lot to go with that it seems can like they, be they, amazing. It seems like they did put a, lot, a good amount of money on this. This does, however, have a, a, a tad bit feeling like that first Godzilla movie that came out in like 2014, mm -hmm. where instead of being... More focus on Godzilla. It was focused on people? Yeah. So instead of being more focused on Master Chief and his journey, it looks like it's hella focused on the people leading up to it, which to me is a problem because I'm not here for them. You're here for Master Chief. You know what I'm saying? Like, when I sign into Halo and I'm about to play the game, I don't want to be like, let's watch the political... No, I want to be Master Chief running next to a warthog, jumping on a ghost and knocking the alien off and being like, you just got granted thought of, son. <laughs> like, things like that. But I could be wrong. The actor who does it, I like him. He's a good actor. He's built. He's a good. Uh, uh, I, I immediately connect him to uh, Orange is the New Black. He's one of the guards in that. No one's just serious. It's high. It's high. Like it started off really good, and then it just it, it had a decent ending. But um, I immediately think of that character. Apologize for the brain fart. But I think physically and visually, he looks like it. I'm just like the voice kind of threw me off because like Master Chief has a very Specific voice, mm -hmm. especially because it's a it's a uh, first player game. Yeah, like you see these hands, and you hear him speak. Mm -hmm. So I think that's like my only thing that caught me off guard because he's like Alpha Team with me. I said, "Who the fuck is that?" Mm -hmm. I was like, "I was like, where's Master Chief? You dress like him, but that's not him." Wait, wait a minute, you you dress like him, you walk like him, but you ain't him. Pasta. Um, but uh, and then the face thing. But again, I could be wrong. The show can be great and all that. So I'm excited. I'm gonna give it the benefit of the doubt. I gotta sign up for Paramount Plus. Apparently, they don't understand that. Like, oh, I have it. So I there you go. I need more bills. Psych. Ha. But um, let me know down below. Are you excited? What do you think of the show? Do you care for the game? Uh, what's your favorite video game based movie of all time so far? Down below in the comment section, comments, questions, concerns, requests. Let us know. We love hearing from you. But until next time, adios. Goodbye.